What's up guys? Welcome back to The Surge. Nah, I made it to the third sector of the game now. The result by our left. So, I seem to be underground and also I saw these like construct uh, collector bots. It seems that these guys can actually like steal items that are put on the floor. Fever hey! But you can attack that laser which disables its um, powers of shooting lasers. There you go. Don't know why I wasn't attacking. I think this goes and charges the bit down here. And whoop, yep. Uh Auto aid V2. Well, near death regenerates have buzz actually really good. Whoa, floating box. Cool. <laughs> Can I be a floating cat? Imagine that animals that fly, like. Oh, I know that exists. No, I mean, like, cats and dogs swimming with wings flying around the place. It'd be so weird. I would love it. <laughs> Not rad, man. Yeah. So they seem to be able to like spit some like oil gas stuff at you and then that and then that like disables movement by a hell of a lot. Uh do just wait, let me just check something. Organizer Nah, not organizer. You got schematic. What parts does Scarab up? Well, I need a Scarab Torso. You have no Scarab Torso. So I will kill you. You have a Scarab Torso. So I'll take that. Wait for it. Yay. See, the thing with me is even if I don't use the armor, I still actually want it for completion purposes. Okay, I think this will power the elevator. I mean, if it says core power 10, you use it for the main storyline. Don't worry, Warren. You'll be looking much cooler. Put some elevator music into the game. They should actually do that a lot. Elevator music into the game. That would be make the game much better. Mm. 
Fucker. I already have that rhino armor. So I see you back here. Oh yes, another mobile med station. That's very useful. The heart, the, yeah, that heart looks like I'm in. No way, I can't remember what I was gonna say. Damn it! <laughs> Oh, that dude's got full armor. Oh, I killed him. I didn't realize I killed him. Your honesty is humble. Oh god, these are when this dude has come in. And I find them very annoying. Especially here that I have two of them. Uh oh. But yes, I definitely called many things over the years and <laughs> Welcome to the battle area. <laughs> Your honesty is humble. Oh, he just flipped himself off. Also two, they are actually growing brains. They can now come up there. I knew that was gonna happen. I remember these guys are actually in the the first sector of the game actually. A like hidden sector. It's a hidden bit of the game. I'll actually go back go to it when I go back to the first uh, second sector, I mean. This isn't about personal glory or fortune. Project Azar. best minds on the planet are all working together with Creo's crack team of scientists and developers to make sure that we can have not just a future, but a new beginning. I'll see if I can turn this video that chance to start afresh. actually manages to... I mean... We're all in this together. And together, we will overcome. Thank you so much for taking Just time out of wait. your busy schedule to talk to us today can only hope to live up to your example. Thank you, Don. Thank you. And thank you, all of you who work so hard. Oh, I just reset the video already. Project Resolve's mission. I know from talking to many of you on the production floor that Creo was. <sighs> it's a calling. And again, I thank you. Without you, my dreams would be just that. There we go. It's my utmost pleasure to have Jonah Gutenberg, the founder and, dare I say it, brains behind Project Resolve with us today. <laughs> Jonah, if I may call you Jonah. Absolutely. We don't need to stand on ceremony here. As we like to say, at Creo, we're all family. It's a privilege to have you here. You've been called many things over the years, from boy genius, your startup days, to a potential savior of humanity. Well, I wouldn't go that far. But yes, I've definitely been called many things over the years, and not all of them as nice as that. Hello. <laughs> Wait. Hello. Your honesty is humbling. The truth is, while politicians and scientists were fighting and trying to lay blame, you stepped forward with a solution. Look, the fact of the matter is, something had to be done. Where does arguing get us? Nowhere. Some divorce lawyers may disagree there. <laughs> True, but our problems are global. We needed to step up to the plate. 
I was fortunate in the timing and position that I was able to do so, but I wasn't unique in the desire to make a change. This isn't about personal glory or fortune. Project Resolve is the largest endeavor of its kind. The best minds on the planet are all working together with Creo's crack team of scientists and developers to make sure that we can have not just a future, but a new beginning. The chance to start afresh. We're all in this together. And together, we will overcome. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule to talk to us today. You can only hope to live up to your example. Thank you, Don. Thank you. And thank you, all of you who work so tirelessly to fulfill Project Resolve's mission. I know from talking to many of you on the production floor that Creo is more than a job. It's a calling. And again, I thank you. Without you, my dreams would be just that. Okay. So now we know who was behind the uh, project resolve thing. Dude called Jonah Gutenberg. Yeah, Jonah Gutenberg. Oh god, I just realized my health. Needs a power. But there is a power. What's a new weapon? I want that. Weapon I don't want. There's one of those dogs. Part of me. This very second. Yeah, it does that up flips and then it can do that. And then do its leap and then you can slash it. Well, I do remember. You had a new weapon. Now remember there's a dude over there who is pretending to be dead, but he's not and he's a dog and I don't feel really like fighting him because I will, will die. Because I'm out of injections and my health is extremely low. I want to do what I do. There, there he is, see that? You see that in blue light? I could do with a little help here, you know. Time All right. Now listen. I'm sure you're smart enough to realize this area is under lockdown. Quarantine. Whatever goddamn excuse they're using to get at me. I need to get out. We have to break this lockdown, and by we, I mean you. Care to tell me who you are? My name is Dr. Chavez. Melissa. Maybe you've heard of me. And no, I'm not lost. I work here. I think that's enough small talk. Now how about getting me out of here? Good plan. It'd be nice if there were more specifics. I'll put this as simply as possible. Enter the largest of the greenhouses. Look for the main console. It's connected to all the systems in this sector. I'm sure you can figure out the rest. Ask nicely and we have a deal. If I hadn't asked too nicely, you'd have known. I'm off. Well, you know where to find me. Right. She says she works here, she doesn't actually. I remember at the beginning of the game I got this 
uh, message. Oh, I've got this little audio log, that's what I'm looking for. I've got an audio log saying they fired Dr. Chavez. And she is Dr. Chavez. So how can she work here if she's been fired? Ha uh ha! -huh. Memory is amazing! Oh wait, ah, god damn it! <coughs> I'll be going back up that way, I'll get on my way up. Uh, nothing back there. Decommissioned. Uh, but yeah, I'll quickly get all my health and stuff back. Uh, bank. Yeah, I'll get it so that I get another implant slot. Increase core power. Don't really need the increase yet. I don't feel like that. I don't know how I feel about that. I'll give everyone one of these. And I do need a stamina increase. Uh, no. Okay, uh, what upgrades and stuff can I get? That's the way. I think this sector of the game is actually Mark Free. Hmm. Let me let me get a weapon from an enemy. To stop you, but it is not recommended that you leave operations. Let me get a weapon from an enemy, and then see if it gives me Mark Free. Because if it does, I'm going to do some farming probably off camera. Remember to get this. You know this stuff is toxic, right? We can't just keep dumping it wherever on the facility. We've had another accident. Well, thank God he's only a cripple. Or uh, is it cheaper for the company if they're killed outright? Listen, if the EHA ever heard of any of these incidents, we could close down faster than one of those rockets goes up. <sighs> so, do I get Mark Free on the equipment? So, ah, oh, Mark Two. God damn it, game. So I do remember where to go, and I'm going to wait for you to go away, so then I can go to where I need to go, which is through here, run, 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 and then there's a hole in the floor, jump in the hole in the floor, can't get me down here, meh. My conclusion is I'll die if I jump down there. Okay. Also, another conclusion of mine. He's not dead. Please notice, decontamination has been initiated. Run, 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 run. Have been deployed. Yeah. For your own safety, avoid the following sectors. Laboratories and Ooh. the greenhouse facility. I see the target. Your legs weekend! Ha ha! Ha ha! And your arms are weakened. I think I'm almost done with this sector of the game. Do I want that? Can you scan it? Ah, uh, all weapon. Even if I don't use it, I'm still going to have it. So I got this. That's good. This, that's good. Did you have anything? Oh, you didn't have anything. Why does no one have anything in their boxes? 
I do this for nice things in the boxes, but there is no nice thing. This is why we can't have nice things. Elevator currently out of order. I didn't even have to go up here. Well, there it is. How did I miss that? There you go. Hug the wall, hug the wall, hug the wall. You know, there's tree huggers. I'm a wall hugger. <laughs> Let's go. What? What is that? In my elevator of elevatedness. a new video, it's a repeat of the one that was on the stand. You have full armor. The game loves me because it's weakening the heads, and the heads you do most damage at. Well, it's kind of obvious anyway. <gasps> okay, I think this. Yeah, this is the main greenhouse bit. Now, as memory said, there's an item back here, but there's a. really good. You know my things, I have to increase my health. This is those, but stronger, so it heals even more health. Oh, I see you there. Well, uh, come at me, come at me, come at me. Eat it! Eat it, female dog. There we go, lift the lockdown. Lockdown deactivated. Reinitiating systems. Attention. Access restrictions for this sector have I know the solution is here. It's under my nose. I can smell it. But where? I failed to notice the long-term effects of resolve. Yeah. What? That's on me. Huh? Gutenberg and Co. hadn't been pushing so hard to start the process. What do I think it? We needed more time to test. Uh, it's too late to cry over spilt milk. 
I can fix this. As we like Resolve to say. is the solution. I just need to identify the elements that produce the toxicity. These guys have changed. They're now flamers. Okay, they're wearing the liquidator armor, so I don't have to worry about getting new dudes. They got a flamethrower. Ah, oh, how fun would it be to go around with a flamethrower? No flamethrower. Oh yeah, because this game hates you, and the only range weapon you get is a drone. God damn it, I thought I was out of reach. Ah well, I'll just charge him. A message. I need help. The Creo team has turned up. I managed to escape to my lab. I'm safe right now, but I don't know for how long. I need assistance. Please. It doesn't look like they can the team. Right. You're a dog. And I'm gonna run past you. Wait, I'm gonna do something actually. Make him jump and then I'm gonna go run past him. Run, 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 run. Item. Ooh, drone. Ooh, drone mod. So wait. Concussion. I got this one. Oh, it's a pollen enemy. Oh, it's like a magnet. Pull the enemies towards the magnet so then I can. Thingy. I see you there, so you make me go and get that and then you jump me. Yeah, this sector is like one of the shortest sectors in the game. Also, does my eyes deceive in me? No, 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 no. That was my work. That was my life. Fuck you. You hear me? Why am I even doing this? They just don't deserve it. They. Let me in. Let me in there. Look at that. You can keep the oh, yeah. by the way. Your drone looks like it needs it. So I think I can overcharge those things. It's not good enough anymore to have me fired and blacklisted. No. Off with her head. So she can't piss on our parade. Just look at this. Months of work destroyed. This is a nightmare. An utter nightmare. Sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't even thank you. Who are you, really? Dr. Chavez. Once, everyone here knew. My team and I were Project Resolve. I helped create it. Ran the labs. But those days are gone. When the problems with Resolve became apparent, I was quickly sidelined. My former colleague was more than eager to put forward his own proposal and take my position. And all the board cared about was that it was cheaper and faster. Nothing else mattered. You know what's going on here, don't you? My work here is unofficial. I'm no longer part of Creo. The reality is, I don't exist. Whatever happened, it wasn't our doing. I have my theories, but until I have more information, they'll remain my theories. I haven't heard anything from my associates in days. It's anarchy out there. I'm worried that... <sighs> Look, I know. I owe you already. But I need another favor. Depends on the favor. Okay. This chip holds important data. Data that will save resolve. And humanity. I need to trust you on this. 
I wouldn't survive five minutes out there, let alone make it to the Executive Forum. You're my only chance to do this. Give it to Bonham or Fox. They're both on the board. It's crucial they get it as soon as possible. Okay, hand it over and it's done. Hurry. We're counting on you. The encrypted data chip. Look at Something this. Something is wrong with the compound. I know the science is right. Everything checks out perfectly. At least at a theoretical level. Of late, though, I've been experiencing a heaviness in the chest. And occasionally when I exert myself, it takes a minute to regain my breath. The scans aren't showing anything yet, but... I'm beginning to wonder if it's due to working directly with these materials. Do you require assistance, Warren? My eyes do not deceive me. I have just done this entire sector in one in one blimmin thingy. Ah, uh, wait. I have done this sector in one video. Thy eyes do not deceive thy. I thought thy eyes deceived thy, but thy eyes do not deceive thy. Oh, don't need that, I'll get that. It's more important. Right, wait, Zinna has lifted. Can I speak to thingy now? This communication device no. is locked down. All lines blocked. Look out for your fellow workers. They look out for you. Okay, I'm gonna go to the um Next stop, Central Production B, outbound trains. I'm gonna go to Central Production B and go to my operations. I'm just gonna leg it to operations and um I think that'll be it for this video. I think my video's like gradually getting longer and longer. Wait for it. The last episode, I'm just gonna do like an hour or two. <laughs> now nah, we'll keep it around 25 minutes. Uh, an hour plus five minutes. You know, about that time. Not too long. Just your average gameplay you thing. Say it again and and again. Not big game. Holy God! Look at that thing! It's massive! Oh! Ah, oh, and this is the next boss of the game! I have to defeat this and that as the next boss of the game. Also, as the introduction of them, these guys come into the sector as well. Anywho, I'm gonna go run straight to Ops and then be done, did it. Wait, the enemy just... Those guys just killed uh, a dude, and then I just got the egg. They got some tech scrap because an enemy killed another. There, there is again. Uh, if if that's the, if that's the case, then I'm just gonna let my enemies kill each other all the time. But I mean, endless mm, tech scrap here. Now I have to defeat the next boss. What's good about the next boss is because each boss gives you a weapon. Like Pax gave me a single rigged weapon and Firebug gave me a twin rigged weapon. This one gives me a spear and as you know I'm going for a spear run in the game. No! Stop it! Stop! Do you require assistance, Warren? I lost your signal for a bit. Everything okay? Warren? Right, alright, give me a sec. Yeah, really nothing new. Uh, 
Um, I'm going to end this video here. Hope you like the video. I still need to think of a proper outro. If any of you guys can think of a proper outro, please get it say in the comments. Also, I do want to know if you are dog dudes or cat citizens, as I said in one of my older videos in the Youth Fortnite one. Um, have a good Mao day. Mao Mao day Mao Mao. Uh, Mao bye. Bye Mao Mao. Bye Mao. Mao bye.